Uh, we'll get to all that in just a moment, but first we begin with some breaking news after an MCSO deputy involved in an early morning crash. This is a bad one. Too. Yeah, we're told the deputy hit a semi near baseline and rural roads. So that is where Gibby is this morning. Finding out more information. Get. Good morning. Yeah, we are just updated by the Tempe Police Department who took over this investigation. But let me show you our AZ family drone, which will give you a better idea. We can now see that that semi is a Coca-Cola truck there that was traveling eastbound, according to the Tempe Police Department, uh, when it collided with that MCSO deputy who was driving southbound. Both drivers had to be taken to the hospital. They are telling us non life threatening injuries. They are continuing to investigate this uh, crash here to figure out how this all happened and what happened here. But they will have this intersection closed for quite some time. We see an all towing uh, wrecker who is out here on scene now, hopefully to write that Coca-Cola semi truck onto its wheels. We are also asking uh, if there was a pursuit going on at that time. Uh, we're waiting to hear back from the Tempe Police Department uh, on that type of information as well. Some of the information we need to clear up from them uh, in the uh, information they gave us was that the MCSO deputy was T-boned in this in this collision. But by looking at that damage, uh, Gina, you could see there's a lot of front end damage to huh. that SUV. And then with the uh, with the Coca-Cola semi on its side, uh -huh. it's almost like it's reversed. Uh, at least it